So, I guess I'm a ghost now. I'm not really sure how I died, but there are tons of ways it can happen. I mean, just look on the internet. Maybe for me it was something to do with uh, microplastics. I'm learning the ghost rules. I can't leave the house, so Postmates it is. I can see and hear stuff, but did you know that ghosts can smell too? I guess I never really thought about it. Another fun fact, ghosts don't get allergies because I can smell a lot, and that's not always a good thing. Hey man, there's still dirty dishes in the sink. I can do all the normal creepy ghost stuff, bang on doors and move stuff gently. But that gets old pretty quickly. So what am I still doing here? I don't even know who I'm supposed to haunt. I'm no murdered king or sufferer of unrequited love. My life was pretty undramatic. So now my afterlife is pretty boring too. The good thing about being such a loser when I was alive is that not much has changed. I'm living or not living the same way I did before. I still go to work. I'm getting some weird noises. Can I ask you to mute? I still try to date. Then I keep myself entertained. Hey man, uh, the internet's down. Can you reset the router? It is frustrating though. I guess it took me becoming a ghost to realize how much my life sucked. Oh sure, I did some stuff. Picked up some nice pieces of paper, metal, and plastic. I guess if I was in some ancient society, they'd toss all this crap in my grave. A lot of help that would be. I don't think ghosts have resumes. There was so much I could have done. So much potential. What a waste. And the only person I have to blame is... Hey man, um, just want to say I'm sorry. Uh, I've been really hard on you and you didn't deserve any of that. You actually deserve better, a um, whole lot better and a whole lot more. Sorry I haven't been able to give that to you and um, I love you.